Hello, everyone. Welcome to a game. I know this title screen doesn't really give away the name of the game, but if, if you know what game this is just by the title screen alone, you know what we're about to get in store for. This game is called Lisa. And the full name, I believe, is actually Lisa colon The Painful. I think that's the full name. I'm pretty sure there's like some DLC slash sequel type games that also came out that were called Lisa the Joyful or something like that. Uh, but as far as I know, this game is just called Lisa. Just that's the full, the regular name of it. And uh, well, it's one of these weird JR, uh, JRPGs, RPG Maker type RPGs that somebody made and released on Steam or other. I'm sure it's on other platforms as well. Uh, yeah. I don't really know what we're in store for. All I know is it's a very effed up type of jacked up story and has very weird humor. And I think it kind of fits in with the October theme of things. I won't say it's a horror themed game, but it's definitely one of those effed up, you know, I don't even know how to describe it. Effed up. It's just an effed up world from what I've seen in the trailer. That's all I can say. And yes, technically this game is supposed to be an RPG. So I'm about to click new game and we're going to see what this game's all about. I'm quite interested. I know this title screen is very primitive. But those graphics, though, I mean, that, that girl hanging in the corner, is that Lisa? I don't know. Let's find out together. Starting it off with a banger. Game by Ding-a-Ling-a-Ding. -a -ding. Well, there goes my banger. You little thief. Stop. Stop! Leave him alone. Shut up, Brad. Brad? Oh, God. He stole our ball. I stole it. Rick didn't do anything. What? You little bitch. Okay, I was like, this is a very effective screen for being a black screen with just red flashes. Now we can at least see who's getting fucked up here at the playground. Idiots. Let's go, guys. Dim graphics, though. <laughs> Are those two kids on the right scared, or do they get beat up, too? Clearly, the one in the middle and the one on the right got whooped. Anyway, thanks, Brad. I guess those two guys just don't say anything. Oh, we're playing the game. I didn't even realize. All right. Oh, and yeah, this is a 2D game. It's not, and when I say 2D, I mean side-scrolling. Of course it's 2D. But it's not like one of those top-down, like, isometric-type RPGs where you're walking around. No, this one's side-scrolling style, y'all. I'm sorry. You didn't have to cover for me. Oh, but I did. I'm sorry, Brad. You better be. Sorry you got beat up. You're not sorry. All right, so am I just, I'm out? Oh, okay, so I can either go to the right where those bullies guys, or the guys that whooped my ass went, or I can go over here to a dead end. Oh, whoa, what the hell? There's like a dude, I'd like is that a dead dude up by the tree? Weird. Anyway, so far we got riveting, riveting walking sound effects. Is that a lawnmower? Somebody mowing the lawn around here? Apparently that's a locked door. Okay. Is this guy mowing his lawn? What's up, dude? Ah, Bradley. When are you going to learn, boy? Okay. When are you going to... I don't know what's going on. Anyway, this seems like a nice little neighborhood. Did I check that door? I didn't check that door. Definitely locked. By the way, none of my other buttons seem to do anything. I can only walk and press A to interact with things so far. This music, though, very ambient. I like that different grounds give me different sound effects for my footsteps. That's kind of nice. Breaks up the monotony. Oh, God. Did I find my house? This shit is loud. Oh. Uh. Hello? 
once again, my son steps into my house. Beat to shit. Oh, fuck. And then he throw a bottle at his head. I'm not buying you another shirt. That's fucked up, dad. Worthless shit, kid. Go to your room. Now. Wow, what a dick. He already got his ass beat, so you throw a bottle at his head? It's locked like always. It's locked like always. Okay, so that room's locked. Is this my room? This must be my room. Damn. Bradley, man, what a life. And I guess that's the intro, because the title of Lisa is on the screen, even though it's real small. Oh, wait, what? Okay. I guess we fast forwarded in time. Hello? You took some joy. Oh, did I? Cool. Who is you? Am I still Bradley? He's very manly for being... Oh, God, now he's got a baby? What the hell? Uh... Shh. It's okay, little buddy. He's throwing him in the air. Oh god, oh god, he dropped the baby. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. I'm so so I'm sorry, baby. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. There we go. Good baby. Come on, little buddy. Let's get you somewhere safe. Oh my god, what a game. Oh god, Lisa, indeed, Rio. What's up, Rio? How you doing, man? Welcome. And also, yes, shoddy, we dropped a baby. Okay, so we're carrying the baby. Let's take the baby somewhere, shall we? Somewhere safe, apparently. Uh, these drunken fools don't look safe. Hello. Brad? What is that? Holy shit. Is that a baby? Yeah. Whoa. A baby? Where did you get that? I don't know. I just found it lying on the ground. Jeez. Dudes, wait. You know what that this means? This means there's a girl out there. Whoa! That means there's hope for humanity! Whoa! <laughs> I bet she's super hot. Totally. Guys, this is serious. Is it a boy or a girl? I didn't check. <laughs> it's a girl. Wow. We need to tell someone. Rando! If we came to him with this, we'd be set for life. All the food and cool stuff we want. Dope, dude. That's actually not a bad idea. The Rando army would be better equipped for something like this. No. No one can know I have her. She's a baby now. But she'll be a woman in no time. She wouldn't stand a chance out there. Brad, that's insane. You'll keep her a secret your whole life? Do you know what would happen if anyone found out? I don't care. I'm keeping her. Brad. I don't care if you guys help me or not. I'm not going to give her up. This is my second chance. Jeez, Brad. Don't worry, little buddy. I won't let anyone hurt you. Okay. Well, weird, but okay. We found a baby. <laughs> and now we're going to take care of her. With my buddies. Also, is that guy's shirt just really small and his nipples are out? Because that's hilarious. Huh. 
Huh. What are we doing right now? Creating like an underground place to keep the baby? Like, what are we doing? I guess so. They made like an underground basement room that they dug and mined out. Oh God. Oh, these are like the pills that they're taking. Like, you took some joy. Is that what these are? I guess so. Okay, so she's starting to get older. So is this Lisa? I'm guessing this is gonna be Lisa, right? Oh shit, did she fucking leave on her own? Oh wait, better not. And she cries. Okay, so he doesn't want to keep taking the drugs, the joy drugs or whatever. Oh, I see. He made her a mask, and now they can go out into the world. Okay. Makes sense. There's a lot to pay attention to here if you want to if you want to figure out what the hell's going on like you gotta just pay attention now she's playing makeup and drawing on his face what a nice dad and then <laughs> she did it to all his friends too awesome Really don't want to confront the dad thing. Oh, he went back down to the cliff, bottom of the cliff and picked up his pills. Or is he? Maybe. Eventually, this will become a game, I hope. Oh, God. Is that a bark? Oh, okay. Yes, it is. Hey, you there. This wild beast won't leave me alone. I'd slay him myself, but I pulled my groin climbing this tree. So give me a hand, will ya? It's just a dog, dude. Oh, my God. This is the battle music. What the fuck? <laughs> what the hell is this music? I love it. It's such a 90s ass fucking rap beat. <laughs> I feel like Will Smith's going to kick in any second right now. <laughs> All right. Well, anyway, we have fight and we have escape. Escape is not an option. Go ahead, Brad. What do you got? We got Armstrong style. We got skills. Cheese legs. Cheese legs is the name of my move. I'm gonna do it. Or no, wait, is cheese legs the name of the dog? Or is that the name of the move I'm doing? No, his name is, okay, so the dog's name is cheese legs. I love it. Wait, input attacks, W for left punch, A for right punch. I see. We actually put in combo combinations. It looks like all four of my face buttons work for my buttons, so that works. Interesting. Wonder how much HP this fucking cheese legs dog has. Murdered that dog. Let's go. Also, we went up a level. But Brad is not happy about it. Dot, dot, dot. Brad won the battle. Brad is leveled up. I learned Buster Punches. That's cool. I got 53 experience points. I'm now level 2. My HP and everything. Basically, all my stats went up a little bit. That's good to know. There are certain combinations you can that count as skills. Okay, Flammy. I'll, I'll take your word for it. I'll figure it out. Or I, I'll try. 
I was just trying different things there. I tried to go around in a circle once. I tried to press the same button a bunch of times. Try to mix it up a little bit. We'll see how things go. You're pretty tough for a whacked out, midlife crisis looking bald guy. You seem like you could handle a lot of pain. Like maybe you could handle some kind of pain related difficulty setting, huh? Am I correct? Oh. There's actually difficulty settings. Uh. Is there any purpose to, uh. I shouldn't say purpose, but, like, is there any, like, is it way harder on pain mode, I guess is what I'm trying to ask. DJ has no idea. I almost kind of want to try it out just to see. Flammy doesn't know either. Wow. The people who played this game don't know, so I guess I'll just stick to normal mode because I have no idea. Huh. That sucks. Anyway, that would have helped, but like I said, I hurt my, my, my H string. Meaning his hamstring, I guess. I'm Terry Hints. People call me the Lord of the Tutorial. I've been traveling the lands leaving my hints for all to see. I'm a pretty big deal. Got a lot of fans. Wait. You seem pretty lonely. Since I'm a nice guy, I'll keep you company. Cool. It's settled. Oh, great. Wow. That was a that was a joined you sound effect if I ever heard one, and I also did not realize you actually redeemed a beatbox redemption there in the middle of that boss or that that battle I had Rio. Maybe next battle, whenever that happens, if we have the sick beat, I will beatbox to it next time. I'm sorry, I didn't even notice it till after the battle was over. Hey, we got music. I guess I could beatbox to this. If this balloon wasn't here, you would walk off this cliff and die. This balloon just saved your life. Thanks, balloon! There is a hint on this tree, mother bucka. Bottles can be very useful. You can sell them. Fill them or make fire bombs with them. Or even just throw them in battle. So pick them up. Slam them motherfucking down. Should I pick up the ones? I feel like that drum roll sound is way off beat. This beat is just. This song is weird as hell. Okay, so apparently the crow is a save point. Good to know. Saving. You can save your game by consulting a crow. Somebody's got to remember you. Hint Lord hints. Jumping. When you are standing in front of a short enough ledge, you can hold up, uh, then press the space bar to jump up. And hold down and press the space bar to jump down. Okay, can I... I wonder which button would... Uh... Oh, okay, it's just A. Got it. Is it Lisa from The Simpsons or No. Definitely, definitely not, Co-Gamer. Welcome to the stream, by the way. How you doing? Caution. Be wary of Terry's good looks. They are dangerously appealing. Always looking out. Terry Bear. Terry. Devastatingly good-looking person, apparently. Resting. If you find a campfire, you can rest. Your party will be fully revived, but be careful. You're vulnerable while you sleep. Anything can happen. But what choice do you have? So saith sweet Terry Wine. Well, time to take a rest and see what happens. This music is weird as hell. By the way, this is the sleep music. Okay. Very epic. All right, apparently nothing happened while I was asleep. That's good. Some slow-ass funk music. I know. And then as soon as we switch screens again, it, the music changed again. Seems like this ledge is a bit too high to jump up to. Uh-oh. Whose blood is this? Oh, shit. Secret's out, Brad. She's gone. Sorry, guy. There's something I gotta go do. Alone. What happened? 
I can't really tell you. Come on, bro, this looks serious. Someone close to me is missing. I need to find that person. That's really all I can say. Ah, shoot, that's sad, dude. I figure you'll need someone to protect you. I don't... I'll tag along, I guess. Considering I'm a very strong warrior. <laughs> that joining sound effect is so weird. Terry Hintz joined you again. Thanks, guy. Even though he doesn't want you to. Alright, time to go in my house and see all my friends got murdered. Dude, they got wrecked. All my friends are dead. All my friends are dead. Stabbed all in the head. He is fucking dead. Sad as fucking shit. Picture of the sky that Buddy drew. Oh, he named her Buddy? Or at least he calls her Buddy. A picture of Buddy's uncles. Rick, Sticky, and Cheeks. Rick, Sticky, and Cheeks. He's dead. Picture of a happy family. You found a rusty knife. Oh, neato. Cool, that's what I came here for. To pull the rusty knife out of my homie. Who's fucking dead kind of funny because we just did that in like uh that suffering game we definitely pulled our first weapon out of an or out of a homie that died these are some weird equipment things by the way sweet sweetie wristbands sweetie sweaty wristbands wrist bands jesus hint lord sweatbands so i don't seem to be able to equip this knife weapons don't use this on your dinner. You'll get sick. Can cause poison. Yeah, okay. Thanks. By the way, there is a menu now. There wasn't a menu earlier, but there is one now. Wait, what does his status say? A lonely man who puts his heart and soul into his hints. He'd be a real asset if he wasn't so weak. Fucking weak sauce, bro. Alright, well. They took my girl. And now I must find her. Let's save it again. You found some mystery jerky. Uh, oh god. <laughs> so apparently you could just jump off and jump off the cliff and end the game. All right, cool. Game over. <laughs> it's so easy to accidentally just All I did was walk one step and he's just like, "Yep, that's what I want." Ah, oh, that was good stuff. <laughs> Okay, I can climb back up. Let's go get this bag down here. Oh no! The screen, dude, it's tr oh. It scrolled so fast. All right, well, that's the thing we're gonna probably do way too much. Oh my God. Guess that song, No Easy Way Out from Rocky doesn't apply here. Definitely not. All right, found some more mystery jerky. Woot. Wow, it's so easy to just walk right off a cliff, man. This game doesn't give a fuck. What is this? Hello? He's holding something. You found a diet col coco Sorry, a diet Coca-Cola Cola. Coca-Cola Cola, my favorite brand. Coca-Cola Cola. I guess Coca-Cola is probably how you pronounce it. Coca-Cola Cola. That was fun. Let's try not to jump off the cliff anymore. That would be a wise Oh, hello, not friendly looking guy combos. Some characters can use combos in battles via the WASD buttons. Additional special attacks can be performed by entering a specific combo. In your skills menu, you can find out how to do special moves by looking at the button sequence. For example, WWS does buster punches. Does that make sense? Wary Terry. Well, let's take a look at the skill set and see what kind of punches we have. Wait, how do I... It said in the oh, skill screen. Sorry, I was looking at the status screen. So all I have right now is Buster Punches. I guess I didn't really have another... Um, I didn't have another... Combo that I could have done earlier, but now I do. So WWS. I'm assuming the layout is the same as WASD as if I use my face buttons. So if I use YYA, I am using an Xbox controller. Hopefully that will do the punches. I'll figure out in a second. But yeah, let's see. Does Terry have one too? He does not. Alright, well, wait, what is, 
Oh god. Out of my way. I want that little bitch all to myself. Well then. The second RPG is Cola as a healing item. Do you mean Nuka Cola from Fallout Frog? Because as Luminous just mentioned, Carol Carol Cola from Mario RPG was a thing. Also, check out this battle music. It's a little different. <laughs> This fucking beat. These beats are, are cool, but weird as hell. Alright, so anyway, we could do some buster punches. So, wait. I can actually just click buster punch. Or I can actually do them? No idea. We're gonna try it. Ooh, he hit, he hit hard. Alright, so WWS. Okay. Ooh! Ooh, that was nice. That was nice. That was real nice. So what if I just do the skill buster punches out of here? We'll just do the same thing. Also, what does Little Cheer do? Gives an enthusiastic chant. You you, you tell those assholes. And of course, yes, there's regular cola from Fantasy Star. I forgot about that frog. You're right. <laughs> he kicked it to, he kicked Hurt and Terry's eyes, so now he's crying. That's hilarious. Okay, so that felt like that did less damage. Maybe it does more damage if I do the inputs myself. Um, I'll just let him attack this time, I guess. Yeah. Terry is still tearing up. Okay, Terry's attack is useless. Did you see that? He just, like, dives and falls on his face. What if I... I'm going to try something on this one, actually. Shook him. Okay, Terry sucks ass. He's crying and he does zero damage. What a useless bitch. Okay, what if I do, like... Brad is bleeding out. Okay, that's fine. So it doesn't do the buster punch if you don't bleed with it. If you use, if I tried to do two other punches first, and then I did the buster punch combo, and it didn't, it didn't do it. So that's interesting. I'm going to do another little cheer. Oof. Oh, that actually heals. I didn't even notice that that actually healed a little bit. This old salmon's swimming downstream tonight. Got him! Well done. Looks like Terry went up a level and Brad was real close to another one. The Hinster's moving on up, so saith Terry. A little bit of... He, he, all his stats went up one. Wait, what is this? Six mags is what we got? Is that money in this game? I have six mags. I guess that's my money. Bottom... I have six mags. That's what it says. He's dead. He's fucking dead. All right, moving on. Hello. I can't believe it. Such an ugly girl. Now I'm fucking dead, son. Who tore his ass up? Okay. Another mystery jerky. I don't, is the mystery jerky just a healing item? Dried meat of Alathian animals. Recovers 300. Yep. I thought I picked up another one of those. It says I have two of them. This game is so troll millionaire, Will. You will I will love it? Okay, well, let's hope I will love it. Also, welcome to the stream, Will. How you doing? He's fucking dead. I like games that are troll. Sometimes. He's fucking dead. So many dead bodies everywhere, man. Hey! I'm not dead yet, you prick. Come here so I can kick your ass. Wait, really? Really? That's right, tough guy. 
You fell right in my trap. Uh, okay. This guy's super already dying, but apparently he wants to fight. Okay, then. Get fucked, Jeffrey Coomings. His name is Jeffrey Coomings. Oh, I didn't pay attention to the, what that last guy's name was with the, with the fucking spear. Terry is so useful. Or useful. Useless, that is. Ah, god damn it. Anyway, Brad went up another level, so that's good. Also, Terry went up another level. Okay, and he learned Verbal Bash. The Hinster's moving on up. I'm curious to see what Verbal Bash does. I also got eight more mags, so now I should have eight, uh, 14 mags. Okay. All right, well, fuck that guy. Oh. Oh, I actually have to drop down there to get whatever that is. I want that. I do. I don't know what that is, but I want it. I'm dropping down for it. I don't give a fuck. I will do it. I will risk it. I will risk it. This is a horrible idea. I lived. And I got the secret stash of 50 magazines. Yo. Oh, shit. But am I trapped here? Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Am I trapped? I might have fucked up, guys. Well, here we go. Oh, okay. That's just the ground. Oh, it scared me. I didn't know if this was the ground or of endless pit. I can't tell. Okay, we're good. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. I was scared. I was truly scared. More of that jerky dough. Any reason to drop down here? Ooh, that only did 10 damage. No? Alright. Everything's fine. We're doing just fine, y'all. Something tells me these fellas, even though they look like they could be friendly, probably not. Just going to go out on a limb and say probably not. Oh, my God. That's a lot of fellas. All right, man. I'm going to stay here and block the entrance. You guys go around. Uh, go search around in, the, in case she's already been through here. You got it, boss. Sugar Boy Drifters out. Sugar Boy Drifters. What a name. There's definitely an item down there. Uh, oh, there's actually shadow lighting with the fucking candle. That's awesome. Gotta love it. All right, let me go get what's in this bag down here, and then we'll go say hi to Elvis Impersonator Man. Got some perfume. What that do? This sweet scent revives one ally, or an an ally. So it's like a phoenix down. Sweet. Also, what do these joy pills do? This drug makes you feel nothing. Use it in a pinch. Oh, so like, you don't take damage, maybe? Maybe like invincibility temporarily? Could be. Could be. By the way, I never did check what this Coca-Cola Cola did. It actually refills your SP, which is your magic. Well, anywho, let's go say hi to Mr. Elvis Impersonator Man. Hello, sir. Is this a joke, bald man? You think you can handle what's going on out there? Huh. I'll give you a taste. So what the fuck is this guy's name? Sugar Mountain. That's his name. He's the Sugar Mountain. We also have a new weird song playing. Oh my god, this song though. What is this? right now 
Hey! <laughs> Some grindcore shit. <laughs> this song is nuts. I fucking love this. It's so weird. I love it. That beat, that beat, that bass that is on there though too. Anyway, use disparaging words to upset the opponent. This can either make them cry or get pissed. So you can actually do status effects with this, but I don't have any SP right now, so. I guess I'm just gonna attack. This fucking soundtrack so far has been bangers. Bangers! Ooh, that was, mm, that was actually some big damage. I did not like that. I did not care for that. We're gonna have to use one of these mystery jerkies on Scary Terry over here. Sugar Mountain is astounded by my stupidity. That's he just wasted his turn being astounded. All right, I'm cool with that. Get him. I like that Terry's at least doing some damage. He's not doing zero. I'll take an I'll take a minus two. This song is fucking nuts, dude. Part of me loves it, and part of me is weirded out by it. Damn it. Good timing. Hey. Pride flower. Pride flower, indeed. Thank you for the resub for 21 months, Morrow, and welcome to my stream. How are you today? And totally unrelated to talking to you. Hopefully she's already dead, so I can see her in hell. <laughs> Here's a hint. You suck and I rule. That's what Terry says. Sick drops, bro. We got eight mags, a mystery jerky, and a perfume. All right. Good stuff. Now, nah, no worries, Marl. If anything, you timed it perfectly because the music stopped right when you did that. I don't think your song would have... Uh... That the resub song would have went with the that beat, it would have been too loud. The music in this game is loud as fuck. You doing fine? How about me? I'm doing good. This is a weird ass game. It's a weird one. It's a weird one. <laughs> Domestic jerky. Domestic jerky. This car crash looks a little gruesome. Just saying. They're dead. They're all fucking dead. All right, let me go say hi to this guy over here real quick. I wonder if he's good or bad. Hello, sir. Holla, holla. If you hear me. Really needed to get that off my chest. <laughs> and he's dead. <laughs> uh, what is this, Morrow? This game is called Lisa. It's like a... RPG, kind of. It's an RPG. It's fucking weird. Let's just say that. It's a weird one. People dead all over the place. Am I going to add this soundtrack to my playlist? If it's on... If it's if the pl if this soundtrack is on Spotify, 100% going on my playlist. For sure. For sure. Yeah, it's a weird one. It's like a side-scrolling RPG. Pretty rare. Yo, I got a worn helmet. Is that, a, is that equipment I can wear? Uh, no. It is. How come nobody can wear all this shit that I picked up? The dude I'm looking like... The dude I play... At, ah, the dude I'm playing looks like he's a chibi version of Kratos. Kratos, Kratos. Uh... Sure. I get what you're saying, because he's got the beard and the ball. Blah, 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 blah. That wasn't fair. Oh, yeah, I suffered serious damage. No shit, I got hit by a truck. Motherfucker. Time is a great teacher. Sadly, it kills all its pupils. Oh, now I got a scar, bitch. <laughs> he's riding a deer. I love it. Howdy, motherfucker. Our paths have crossed yet again. You remember our time spent as wee lads? I do. Fondly. Wait, are these the douchebags that beat me up when I was a kid? Fucking A. My heart just tumbles with joy thinking about it. Like your head in a dryer. Normally you'd be dead and stripped of your wares by now. 
but I like you, Brad. Let's have some fun. I shout give you a choice. Your yellow-shirted friend's life or all of your belongings. Choose wisely. What will you give us? So you actually get to decide whether or not Terry lives or you give him all your shit. This is kind of hilarious and also quite a choice. Hmm. Which one should I choose, guys? Fucking Terry is useless. But do I give up all of my things? Hmm. I'm trying to think, what do I have? I have a bunch of healing items. I got a helmet and a knife that are both apparently not equipable by me anyways. They made him useless on purpose to, quote-unquote, throw him under the bus. <sighs> but maybe he won't be useless later you know what I mean like maybe he starts out useless so you're like fuck him I don't need him anyways I do have perfume also true those are revival items I'm having a hard time deciding um do I do I care do I care about Terry that's the, that really what it comes down to I kind of like him as a personality he seems ridiculous and silly I should read the second option very carefully. All my belongings? Let him die. Kill that bitch. Damn it, dragon. You violent fuck. I'm trying to think of what else I have. Does it mean he's going to take my clothes also? Like, what else would he be taking? I mean, I'm reading that very carefully, and I'm thinking. Could mean your life. I mean, I guess my life belongs to me. I don't know. <sighs> All right. Fuck it. Terry, you are useless. Goodbye. I, I hardly knew thee. I'm just going to be an asshole in this playthrough. I've already decided. Fuck it. We're going to be the a-hole. Sorry, Terry. Not sorry. <laughs> I knew I liked you, Brad. Bring the yellow shirt man with us. We must make haste. I hear tell that a female is on the loose. My loins ache for some excitement. Off we go. Terry Hintz has been taken. But he's not dead. Not yet. He's just been taken. See, he'll be fine. We'll get... He'll come back. Also, this is where I got hit by the bus, isn't it? Son of a bitch. Yeah, it's definitely where I get hit by the bus. It's going to be awkward if I meet him again later. Yeah, seriously, if he's not dead, it's going to be a little awkward. Maybe now he'll be the hardest boss in the game. It's all right. I'll be fine. For now. Oh, shit. What the fuck? Did he's like, did his, did his dead ass just shit on me? What the hell? That was not cool. That was disgusting. Also, is this a campfire I can rest at? Because I really need to rest. Sir? Seems like a storm brewing around here. You look tired. You hungry? If you have an empty bottle, you can have some of my soup. Also, if you need rest, you can use my tent. I do need to rest, sir. Hell yeah, rest. And he's going to take all my shit. What do you guys think? Did I make a wise choice? Oh, we're fine. Take some soup? Sure. You got a bottle of soup. Hell yeah. What a nice guy. What a nice guy. He rest in his tent. Give me some soup. Glad I didn't waste a healing item. Good times. Oh god. Okay, apparently I got an achievement for Let's Find Her. Did I finish chapter one or something? Anyway, whoa! Holy heck! Um, I'm gonna deal with you in a minute. I was not done over here. Hold on. I wanted to climb up here real quick. There's definitely something up here. Let's check it out. Can I even get up higher? I think so. Wait, can I get over there? Like, if I jump off of there, can I land here? I guess we'll find out. Nope. That's a hot nope. Okay, we'll have to come back for that, I guess. Maybe I'll get an ability or something that'll let me jump across one space of a gap. No idea. 
All right, let's go deal with whatever these guys are. The world can be saved. Finder. Status effects. Oh, God, look at all the status effects in this game. <laughs> cool pick, huh? Arturistic. Or Arturstic. Arturstic? I don't know. So anyway, they're scared, wary, weird, stunned, cry, rage, pissed, drunk, hangover, stink, cool, depression, oiled up, withdrawal, and joyed. That's a lot of status effects. Anyway, scared is like, stop. Wary is like, oh, your defense is up when you're wary? Interesting. Weird means your defense and attack are reduced. Stun is when you're basically stunned. Makes sense. Cry is, okay, cry is like blind, so your vision's messed up. Rage makes you stronger, but pissed makes you also go berserk, okay? Drunk, you are stronger, but you're slow and dumb, okay? Hangover reduces everything, okay? Stink makes people avoid you, okay? Cool is regenerating HP. Depression makes life suck. <laughs> Ain't that the truth. Oiled up makes you flammable, makes sense. Withdrawal hurts you all over, and joy makes it all better. Got it. Got it. So people are looking for this the girl to save the world because, well, she's the only girl that they know about. He's full of holes. Motherfucker got sliced. Joy then withdrawal. Exactly. Well the idea is that you get withdrawal from having too much joy. Also, this guy does want to fight. What is this music? Hello? Bobby Diddle! Yo, check out this beat though. Hey, 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 hey. What a beat. All right, let me beat this guy's ass. Fucking Bobby Diddle. Oh my God. The beat just fucking dropped on this song. Hello? Hello? This reminds me of some, like, like Genesis music, doesn't it? My intestines are in disarray! Get fucked, Bobby Diddle. Get fucked. That beat was fucking sick. That was some straight up Genesis shit right there. Anyway, Brad up to level four. Hell yeah. That was like if Earthbound was released on Genesis. Yeah, kind of actually. It's very, uh, it's, it's weird like Earthbound, but it has that Genesis like sound quality. Anyway, we got another Diet Coca-Cola -Cola for winning and some more magazines. So the actual thing that we are picking up for currency in this world is magazines. That's interesting. Okay, so there's a bunch of caves here. That one's dark. I'm scared. It's too dark. Can I drop here? Ooh, worth it. Because we got a secret stash of 10 mags, y'all. Makes me wonder if they're all, like, dirty mags. Or is it just any mag? I don't know. I mean, why would you collect anything except a dirty mag, you know what I'm saying? Secrets? No? Okay. Can I get up to where that sign is at? I don't think I can get there. Because I can't jump over a gap. There's got to be like a gap jumping move. There's got to be. 